So in my last video, I have done a tutorial on how to play Warzone on 8GB of RAM without having any lags or stuttering. But I found yet another two tricks to do to give you more free RAM space so the game can run even better and boost the performance a little bit more. So I thought of sharing this with you guys and add it to the video. I was trying to play the game on 8GB of RAM and the game was really unplayable and I've tried almost everything until I tried this method and now the game is running super smooth. The method itself is really easy and simple but first don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel and tell me in the comments if it helped you or if you have any questions. Now let's start. Go to control panel, system and security, system advanced system settings advanced tab performance settings advanced and change now you need to pick your fastest drive choose an ssd if you have it of course it doesn't matter if it's the system drive or not for me i have my system installed on the ssd but first make sure that no bgm file is unchecked for other drives after choosing your fastest drive, now click on custom size and depending on the free space on that drive, enter the value between 10,000 and 20,000 megabyte. Make sure that you put the same value in both initial and maximum size. 15,000 worked fine for me. Click on set then apply and restart your PC. After doing the steps from the last video, now go to control panel. System and security, system, advanced system settings, and from the advanced tab, click on settings. This here is like a relationship between performance and the appearance of your system. And what we will do is to take adjust for best performance. This will basically reduce the visual effects of few things in windows such as fonts, icons and animations. So you can do that before every time you play the game and you can change it back as it was if you want. After doing that go to windows settings and then apps, start up. From here you can disable the apps that will start once you log into your windows or you start your computer. So from here you might want to disable as many apps as you can. You can just disable everything to see the difference. Then restart your computer and enjoy the game. If you have any questions drop them in the comments below and I will gladly answer them. And don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.